Hello, I'm Rebecca Cordham from Rice University. Over half of premature babies struggle to breathe because their lungs are immature. In the developed world, this is easily treated with bubble CPAP, but at $6,000, CPAP machines are too expensive for most developing world hospitals. A year ago, my colleague Jocelyn and I came to this meeting to tell you that we had developed a $160 bubble CPAP machine. With support from a Saving Lives at Birth seed grant, we are evaluating this device in Malawi. Our results show that with a standard of care in Malawi, only 9% of babies with respiratory distress syndrome survive. In contrast, 67% of babies with RDS survive when treated with our bubble CPAP system. We now propose in partnership with the Ministry of Health to implement bubble CPAP countrywide in Malawi. We will evaluate its impact and its cost effectiveness to support scale up in Africa, where we estimate that CPAP could, survive, could save the lives of more than 178,000 babies each year. Thank you.